Hello everyone and welcome back to another exciting installment of your Out of the Abyss Adventure. I'm today's DM Smiley. And I'm Evan the Great playing Grom Whitehammer, Paladin Monk, Puncher of Faith. And I'm the Bearded Wonder, I play Trevok Whitehammer, the Fighter Slash Wizard. And I'm JVD playing the Witch Hunter Notch and I'm Hell Raven. Quite literally. Mm -hmm. Put Pithead to shame, motherfucker. Put him to shame. <laughs> so, like and I'm all about the pleasure, not about the pain. <laughs> you, you definitely favor one of yourself. Regardless of how exquisite it may be. And later we'll be talking about the Wishmaster and the, and the specific point where he killed a woman with an orgasm. Mm -hmm. But. That's actually so funny. I love that part. <laughs> <laughs> I just want killer sex. Killer sex? Yeah, killer. <laughs> All right. Starting at the top of the initiative order of our great and wonderful battlefield of destruction and death, we will be starting with the bearded devils. Bearded devils. All right. Um, the first two can attack. The third one is locked up, and I've got another one that's locked up. So I'm going to go ahead and roll their... Uh, was it strength or athletics that they need to roll to get out of that? Strength. Strength, all right. Uh, one of them has a 11, and one of them has a 13. Both fails, DC 15, 14. Okay, so they're both locked down. Yes, they take 2D. Start on the far side of the map, attack in the, go the goblin closest to... It took 9 points of blood to be damaged. On, on, the, on the left? Okay, they both take 9? Yeah. All right. Um, let's see... The beard on the first goblet is an 18. That definitely is. Um, he takes six points of damage. Six points? Is he alive? Uh, barely. He looks right. He needs to roll a constitution save. That's not one. All right. He is poisoned for one minute. He cannot regain hit points. Uh, that's about it. All right. Then we hit him with a blade for 18 points of damage. This should kill him for a whopping 13. That's oh, he's dead. He says so on the right. <coughs> yep. Right. So on the right. Let's mm -hmm. see. Let's mm -hmm. get that off to the side. All right. So, um. The two free ones that I have. All right. Right there. Um, they're going to. Keep on the ones around the water open was actually around the yolk wall. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Yeah. Um, screw it, they're gonna fight her. Alrighty. First one, bearded glaive. Uh, the beard is a, if you would, these two Where at? bearded ones. Them two right up there. Oh, yeah, them? No, not just those two, scoot them up on her. Oh, okay. this way? Yep. Okay. First one has a 20. Yeah, they just need to be up on it. Got 20 to hit. Uh, the other yoke claw gets an attack opportunity just moving away from her. No, no, Evan, they both need to fight that. One, we just needed a five foot step, buddy. So you're going towards the water thing? Yeah, yeah. I'm not fighting her. Oh, uh, the water thing is another yoke claw, Evan. Yeah. Sorry. I just needed a five foot step. So. I, I picked it because it looked so. Why should you go attacking? No, she's not. Okay. It was just that I thought it was moving to the other one. Okay, 20 hit her? Oh, absolutely. Okay. So that'd be nine points of damage. Do they? She's. Can she be poisoned? She is immune to poison, but I figured. The glaive mints are on the one. All right. Second one will be the same. Uh, the beard is a 11. The glaive is a 21. 11 is a miss. All right. For. 13, uh, 11 points of damage on the glaive. Um, she needs to roll me a constitution save. 13. Um, she makes it. All right, so she ain't worry about that. The next one is locked up. Um, then I have this one on the outside in the middle here. He's gonna attack the drow straight in front of him. Uh, that's probably a miss with an 11. It's both 11s. And they are done. Alright. That is your turn, Notch. Notch's turn. 
Swing, swing, swing. Scimitar first. Uh, 16 on the Yoko Law. That's a hit. Um, how about a 15? That's a hit on the die. And then for the short, or I mean, um, Sewell's axe would be a 9. Nine's a miss. Alright, so uh, first attack is 6. Second attack is 5. Alright, so 11 total. Yes, sir. Right, it is the those two guys down there, those two that actually look like Thrall, are going to be attacking the Beard of Devils. The first one's attacking the restrained one. That's a miss and a hit. Okay, which one are they attacking? Uh, the first one's attacking the first restrained one. Okay, so the one in the middle. Yeah. Okay. Uh, they only have an armor class of uh, thirteen. I wrote a, th a 2 and a 3 on the first stack. The second stack was a 5 and a 6. And the last one I wrote a 17 on the die. Okay. And I took I did 3 damage non matchable. <laughs> All their damage comes from poison. <laughs> and the other one is attacking the very first one. That one's free, isn't it? Uh, the very first one? Yeah. I'm, you know, you you're just saying things is not pointing them out. Uh, closest to you. Okay, yes. He is free. Alright. No, that one on the outside is captured. Oh, yes. well, the one in the middle is free. Right? Yeah, he's captured, and then this one's captured. Yeah. Then he took 10 points of damage. Is that, is that half? No, yeah. Not half yet. Okay, so he took five. Yeah. The three was not halved either. Okay. Yeah, oh, I just yeah. saw that one. Yeah. Oh, so it wasn't half. No, you took one that point of damage, my friend. Bone Devil. Bone Devil, sorry. Attack named Yokolaw. Um, you call that sting? Claw, claw. I wrote a critical. Sweet. And then I have a 20. And then for the sting, I wrote almost another critical. Uh, a 27. <laughs> Let's go ahead and get the claw out of the way, the critical. That was cheat, all their attacks are magical. Uh, that would be 15. 15? Mm -hmm. The other claw is a 8. The sting is uh, 12, and she needs, well, she's immune to poison, so doesn't work. Doesn't help me. And the bone devil is done. The bone devil is done. It is Barb Devil's turn. Man, like all, <laughs> it's all me, guys. It's all me. Barb Devils. Um, mm. what are they? The, it's the, the, the one that looks like gargoyles. Okay. Uh, 150 feet flame throwers. Um, he's still on the outside. I'm going to hurl flames at um, the mage on the outside. Uh, that would be a 13, and that would be a 21. 13, 21, both hits. Okay, the first one is 14 points of fire. Um, if it has anything that's flammable, it is now caught on fire. His stick bursts in the flames and throws it to the side, taking it back. Cool. What about the <coughs> cloaks? Don't try to like to wear Fire retardant. Ah, uh, okay. The second one uh, is 11 points of damage. This one's going to roll one at the outside one. That second mage on the my side, Doesn't right? Work. Yeah. Dead. Cool. I missed the other one. I rolled a two. Alright. Fucking Bob Devil. So much for fire retardant cloaks. <laughs> <laughs> he has some fire retardant cloaks, not flesh, okay? Okay, I'm just saying. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying. Grom, it's your turn, buddy. <laughs> uh. Demon. Next are your spine devils, by the way. <laughs> yeah, I knew they were the one thing that went uh, with after Grom. It's two sword attacks. You need your puny sword punches. I've got a legion of hell. A 19 <laughs> and a 1. And then the martial arts beer mug. 
is a 17. The 19 and 17 hit? Okay. So the sword is sweet, sweet, radiant, radiant. Damage. D8 plus 5. 13, max damage. Right on. And the mug, which also goes through damage reduction. I don't know if you knew that. Because it's my flurry. Well, no, you got to be doing flurry bullets for that to work, don't you? No, your, your attack's just magical. Okay. Just with the mug. Yeah. Okay. Um, three, four more points. So 17 four total. Points. Grom, my mugs are my weapons. White hammer. Good. That is all he can do. Uh, spine doubles. All right. Um, <coughs> Kevin, if you will move all them spine devils in three, 20 foot towards this mage. It's outside one's going to go ahead and. These are spine ones, right? Yeah. Yeah. Just move 20 foot closer. Um, Cause they just won't get up on the wizards, for the wizard can do it. You can throw more lightning bolts. Okay, this outside. The, um, uh, the <coughs> tentacles have now all dropped. Okay, cool. Um, I actually cannot reach the mage. Oh, like flat 40, my bad. So move oh. them up. Yeah, another 20. <laughs> They all should be within 20 range of, the, of that one. So, yeah. Yeah. Because I should be able to hit with all my attacks. So, Alright. He's, qu he's seriously questioning his life's choices right now. <laughs> going around the board starting with that one. Uh, um, I wrote a critical. But I also have a 11. 11 hit. 11 does not hit. Okay, so the critical is uh, 7 points of damage. The next one in line, um, does an 11 hit? No, we just, that's a, yeah, we just got that. You were so close to. Second one, um, nope, I rolled a one. Uh, that would be a 22. 22 hits. For the final one, and a 19. 19 hits. For five and five. So 10 damage. Mm -hmm. This is round four, right? And there we go. The drow, the small ones there behind the spider devils are going to be using their crossbows to attack them. Okay. That 20, 5, 15 hit? Uh, yes. That's 2 on the die. And that is 11. Miss? Um, yes. Right. Which one did you hit? I hit the first one with a, the one critical uh -huh. hit. None of these guys have been hit yet. So, first one. Ten, ten, ten piercing damage. Right. He's so right, he I resisted to it. Yeah. Right. And the last one takes three piercing damage. So, that's halved? That's before being halved. Okay. So, yeah. one. Right. And that second round just looks at his crossbow going, why am I here right now? <laughs> why do I serve the lady lord? You're not helping me any. The one nearest the water on your claw, uh, James, if you would, push him up towards that bearded devil on my side, yeah. Fourteen hitting? Yes. Seven damage, half to three. Okay. That's it. Those two will be attacking the one that's engaged with the other bearded devil. Um, then two devils yeah. there. Yeah. So they crossbow, they move it up. Crossbows. These? Okay, cool. Okay. They, they're seeing everyone's kind of fucked right now against these guys. Double ones. <laughs> <laughs> Crossbows blow up in their face. And then a nat 20 on the one in front of him. <laughs> oh. Twelve have to six. Blast. The drow looks very shaken. <laughs> then we got a goblin down there by the two elites. Move that hit the one on the north side near the elites around to the the spike. <coughs> yeah, around to the bearded devils. This way. Yeah. Yeah. Five on the die. Yeah, that are my guys. Travel, it's your turn, buddy. <clears throat> Yours is the mage. Alright, I'm going to take a foot step back, and I'm going to fire a firebolt 
at uh, this picture because my hand actually didn't seem to have much of a foot through. That's a 20. That is a 20. Roll your 2d10 damage. Or a whole three points of damage. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Have, because she's resistant. <laughs> so, uh, we had two yellow balls for fighting, right? Yes. Okay, that's what I was thought. One is the main one you were talking to, and then yeah. she summoned a second. Summoned another one, yeah. I just wanted to make sure. And it's her turn. And she is going to say, my queen gives me strength. And she will attempt to attack the bar, the bone devil. 18. An 18 should hit him, yep. No, no. it misses. 18 misses. A 19. So you see her hand glows red and violent. And she goes to reach out for it, and Bone Devil jumps back. Or maybe he just grabs it. That'd be more Yeah. Epic. He just grabs her hand <laughs> <laughs> and pushes back. In fact, I don't think he wants to touch the hand. <laughs> the second Yoko will be lashing out to the one attack eats on... From where I'm at, the second and the third one. The two directly in front of her. <laughs> so she's attacking what's caught between the yoke locks, right? Yeah. Okay, so the first one? Uh, 19 and a 16. Okay, they both hit. Yeah, they both take 1d6 damage. So that's 4 and 7 damage. That half? No, it's not. Magic. It's considered magical. Okay, so 4. Oh, now my bonus. They've all finally been hit. That means 7. At the Travok, you can see it from where you're positioned. No, Grom was coming from the other way. Grom, from where you're at, you can see a small figure walking down the road with three humanoid wing figures flying circling above him. And he's whistling. He is. He's whistling the Kill Bill King. <laughs> 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 And you'll see a small P fly out of his hand. Oh my god. Through the fence. Okay. Give me a 20 foot radius. Get as many drow in it as you can. Um, I guess like right here. Yeah, because my guys are flying. So. Like, so yeah. Yeah. He doesn't care if anyone else is in it, just try getting as many drow in the oak wall as you can. And I need to roll 8d6 for Boobinose Fireball. Yeah, you picked the guy who went a little freaking low here. Uh, 21. 21? Uh, Death so who? So I would who assume that we can probably hit the Burger Devil too if we need to. They're immune to fire. Um, yeah, so. Right here, I guess we'll yeah, hit yeah, everybody. Right here, so. Yeah. Just right here. So my elites and yeah, those good. three throw. So that's 19 to 21. One for the elites. And that 20. What the fuck? 18 on the die. They're all dodging perfectly. <laughs> I know. <laughs> it's 18 on the top. No, they're not dodging perfectly. They have pissed themselves, and so it's like, killing the flame. Now, the smaller drow died regardless. <laughs> <laughs> yes, but in a different way. Yeah, they're and Boobino is about 60 feet off, like just past the edge of the map. At least on New Year's, they're breath leaving their body as <laughs> burned alive. So, which one's that? The three, go the goblins. The three goblins in the back. Four goblins. So this and this one? I can't even see that motherfucker shit. Yeah, you've got like yeah. <laughs> three more up in there. So he's dead? He, he's dead. And then the one this on the... One? Yeah. What about the one on the... Did he get this one? Yeah, technically, yeah. Yeah, it would. And more life choices were requesting this day. <laughs> this one? <laughs> <laughs> I actually fire. forgot the mage. If a mage is going to see this, 
and where you, you believe the other might piss himself, a dark stain appears on his robes, <laughs> and he's going to blink out. <laughs> he did not wear the brown pants. <laughs> Counterspell. <laughs> if you have, have it, man. I don't have it. <laughs> man, you know, I, I don't have it either. I had to spell magic. He's like Val. But Boobino has arrived with three Aranyas. Oh, cool. He told you he was summoning devils for you. Yeah. You want to work yet? Okay. He's about 60 feet off from where y'all are fighting at. Okay. So he's not actually on the map yet. And it's the Bearded Devil's turn. All right. And I'm going to start over here with the two drow leaves because that oh, side's free. Yep, all the tentacles are free. I find that every time I'm worried about a counter the one, one, but I also have on the glaive a 22. A 22 is a hit. A little 10 on him for 5 points of damage. He's got to make me a constitution saving throw. One. Cool. He's going to take another 10 points of damage at the start of his turn because he has an infernal wound. Nice. It increases every time I hit him. The next one in mine is also going to attack him. This is the outside growl. So, uh, beard is a yeah. The beard's probably a miss with a thirteen, a twelve, thirteen. Yeah, so I'm critical on him with a glaive. Sweet. So, about two. Uh, one again. All right. So oh he takes God. thirteen points of damage plus another five points of damage. He's got two infernal wounds. Okay. <laughs> it, it takes the infernal wound damage at the beginning of his turn? Um, yes, and then every time I hit him with my glaive, he, it, it increases by a deep hit. Now, when he goes, he looks like he's about to move after being struck and he's so wounded, but as he does, his, the wounds burst and the bunny falls over. And the devil is black. This one? Yeah. Yes. Alright, now I'm going to talk. start my melee going down the line against the Yokolov. Um... A 22 is a beard, and I rolled a 1. That is a hit. Um, don't have to worry about poison on her, but she takes 9 points of damage. Next one in line. Um, will be an 18 and a 15. Both hit. Alright. Beard is a 7. The glaive is a 6. You just gotta make me a constitution saving throw. 22. All right, next one in line would be a 17, no, an 18 and a 19. Both hits. Uh, three points of damage. Then five points of da uh, damage. You got to write another constitution saving throw. One. <laughs> if I die, either roll really high or shit right now. Two points of damage from Infernal Wound. The last one in line. Um, how about a 21 and it? a 14? And 14 is a mix. For three points of damage from the beard. And this he takes a d10 at the start of a turn? Uh, let's see. At the start of each of its turn. So. Right. This okay. yoke law looks like as her form's like writhing and twitching, the wound's glowing, but it's not leaking blood, it's like this green vapor. And she looks like she's barely able to hold up her gelatinous, waxy form. Um, Tack is the last one on the end. Beard is an 8. Uh, and then a 23 with the glaive. For 12 points of damage, roll me a constitution save on it. Uh, how much damage? 12. He's dead. Cool. That's he, he just takes the glaive Quink! and cuts yeah. off his head. He's dead. And then grabs it with his beard and bobbles it around. His, 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 beard, his beard is just holding it and caressing it. <laughs> I found the toy. I found the toy. <laughs> his name's Attila. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's just your turn, buddy. Swing it on the one in front of me. Three attacks. Um, how about a 23? 23 is a hit. And a 15. Fifteen's a hit. And then a critical. Critical's a hit. <laughs> so, uh, five points of damage. Six points of damage. 
The circle on the short sword. Eight points of damage. Eight points of damage? No, I take that back. It is only five points of damage. Oh. It's an offhand weapon. I'll get it. And that is a gun in me. Right. Cursing her in Infernal. She tries to look like she understands what she's Roger saying. They're like, oh, you don't say. Cool, man. <laughs> well, said the Bone Devil's pleasure. The Elite Warrior turned. There's one. He is not a stupid man. He's seen his mage leave. He's seen every other ally he had here die, except for the Yokals. <clears throat> they don't care if he lives or dies. But he does not think he can make it out here alive, even if he runs. Or chop. Let him run. He firmly believes that if he tries, the bard and spine devils would just shoot him down. Because they'll do that if he stays. So either way, he's going to die. Yeah, then he misses twice and he's ready. <laughs> 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 Hey, he might be the one drow that kills everything. <laughs> very, very true. Being from technology. He does have plenty of hit points right now. <laughs> Bone Devil's turn. Alright. Second of your claws. Oh. Uh, they're both 26s. Both 26s? And Sting is a 17. So I'm sure those are all hits, correct? Yes, they are. Okay, claw. 11. Five. Sting is a twelve, and she's immune to poison damage. Now, when he grabs the yoko, he rips into her, and then when Sting goes through, you see Spiles faintly has her body burst into a poisonous cloud. Cool. I need everyone to make a costume saving throw. Devils are immune. Out of range. Advantage. Uh, you are dwarf, so yes. Yeah. I'm out of range. No. Twenty foot radius. Which includes the drow right there that cursed his life. And what save is it? Con. 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 Get it, baby. Mm. Yeah, plus, plus one for my thing. Oh, yeah, we get plus one for random thing, too. Wow. Let me roll. 20. Uh, and a 15, so. That's a 23. I got an 18. Twenty-three. Twenty-three. Eighteen. Eighteen. One. I rolled a one. I can add my one to Constitution. I can add Evan's charisma number one to do my thing. So you got a total of three. <laughs> and... Throw all in critical. I just roll up. I'll go. Notch, you and the drow back there both take 25 poison damage. Cool. Now you two take... 12 poison damage, halved because you're resistant. Dead. Okay. And you and the other route are poisoned for one minute. Cool. You, get, you repeat the same at the end of your turn. Do, 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 do. Oh, this yeah. one's gone, right? Yes, it's Pupito's turn. Uh, no, I should, that's, I'm just acting the one in the middle. My bone devil was. My bone devil oh, was fighting shit. That one. Okay. We were fighting that one. Alright. I thought, I, thought, one gets poisoned. I thought he was fighting her this whole fucking time. Okay, well, yeah, go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> that's my bad. No, it's cool. Now we can just Let's focus stop backtrack. Yeah, now we'll just focus fire on the gold. That's why she was yeah, attacking the bone devil. That was the bone devil to leave her to us. I misunderstood. I apologize. Yeah, it's, he was fighting. I've been doing game. that this entire battle. Ooh, <laughs> All right, no, that's cool. It worked. Now the mist mist is still in the area. Mm -hmm. At the start of your turns, I need I, I will need y'all to start making costumes and saves. <clears throat> But it's Boobino's turn. I don't, I don't control Boobino, you did. 
Oh, uh, that was just for when he got there. Oh, okay. Um, Fireball. Fireball Mage. Oh, wait, Mage uh, disappeared, right? Yeah, Mage is gone. Oh. Yeah. Um, yeah. See. There's one. There's like a couple guys over here. Yeah. You just kill this guy. I don't even know. Um, here, go ahead and put him on the edge of the map. Like over here. Where's yeah. he coming from? Um, he's going. He's walking down the road. Okay. Um, this he's just going side. to fireball the two ones way over there. Alrighty. We'll get the yoke wall in as well. Twenty-seven points of damage. Got a sixteen. That'll beat it. An eight. That won't beat it. And an eleven. That won't beat it either. Is it 26? 26. That was 13 for the Yoke Law. The two drow down there are dead. I figured. And following Bubido's turn. So these two? Yeah. Yes, it is the Barb Devils. Barb Devils, cool. Um, well, um, this one is going to charge that drow. Two claw, two it's tail on two claws, so two claws first. That would be a fifteen and a nineteen. Fifteen nineteen hit. And then for the tail, that would be a, another fifteen. So nine points of damage, seven points of damage, and ten points of damage. Um, the other two will charge the yoga off. These two? Yeah, they'll jump off the fence at her. Um, I'm probably just been sitting up there on the fence the entire time throwing fire everywhere. Like, they're just going to die. Draws. Uh, these are both 21s. And I missed with an 8. So, 5 points of damage, 5 points of damage. The other one. Roll a one and then a twelve. Hell, almost critical for twenty-five points of damage. I mean, twenty-five to hit. I wish I could roll twenty-five damage, but I will <laughs> gladly take uh, fourteen points of damage. Fourteen. Okay. Thirteen. All right. All right. Yeah. <laughs> blood board. It's more like blood master. But. <laughs> Next should be dead people's yeah. turn. What? Next are dead people's turn. Mm -hmm. There's not really any of them left. There's one person. Crowd in the distance, you see Duragar coming up, but they are a ways out. Grub's turn. Well, this poisonous gas cloud, how far would I have to move out of it to get away from it? It's a 20 foot radius. You gotta make your save first. Yeah, make, make me con save with advantage. Yeah. That's a. Uh, 18. 18? Yep. You take six points of poison damage, half to three. Uh, let's see. I will see the poison. Trying to get out of the cloud, but fight still. You just turn the button on your phone. Huh? Said so you're trying to get out of the cloud. Oh. <laughs> you're trying to keep 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45. He's dead. He's dead, buddy. I'm dying. I just stuck in there off the top. <laughs> there's one in, there's two enemies that's on the board. I drown and you go claw. I made my save, there. so fuck it. He charges up and. Well, he has a. You can move on to the next side of it. Yep. just dive in and punch your yep. devil. Right there, he's martial arts. My two sword attacks is a 6 plus 8, which is a 14, and a 12 plus 8, which is a 20. 20 hits. And then my mug attack is a plus 6 with a 1. Ah, did you skip me? No? No, you didn't. Yeah, you made three attacks against her. Okay, yeah. Oh, okay, you did the same round. A little lost here. Eight plus five. Eight, 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 eight points of damage. That's all I can do this turn. Eight points of fucking damage. I'm lost. As 
this was the remote or the sword? Sword. The sword swings through and cleaves into the oak law. And it's for it's trying to keep its form to get its waxy form together, but it starts to slowly ooze down and then finally it swells up and pops with blackest icker. Save? Save. Oh. But she is dead. Oh yeah, another poisonous cloud. No, she didn't. <laughs> she just turned her black. Spine devils, and this drow, <laughs> this drow. What drow? This oh, drow. that drow. That <laughs> one guy. Question yeah. him. What are you questioning? They all surround him. All the spine devils do, and they start shooting. How about I say he goes to hold up his hand as you start? <laughs> um. Watch them all miss. They all miss. <laughs> <laughs> really? The first one did. The second set. Would be a little bit different. A 23 and a 17. The first one just tried to scare him. Yeah. They were just joking. They take the, the 23 hits. Uh, for three points of damage. How about a 19? 19 hits. For five points of damage. And the last one. Nope. So he goes to raise up his arm and looks. Yeah. <laughs> Try <so> walking. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he was really doing what the spirit being, what's it called, gonna be doing? Spirit bomb? Yeah. <laughs> There's no drow around to help me find that spirit bomb because no one else would. <laughs> See, what I like to think of the drow are just so selfish they wouldn't give their energy. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> You're on your own. Um, give me him. I think it's it. No, I mean, 18 for the save. Oh, yeah, you're good. Okay. 46. Is that guy still standing? Yeah. And that gives me one of seven. You take four after being half from the. I don't know, that's a fence <clears throat> there. But I thought it was like a uh, wrought iron thing. I'm not sure. I'm it's a that. barge fence. Okay, yeah, there you go. Yeah. So, uh, you can give him some cover. I'm just going to throw it's a fireball. It's meant to poke you in the butt as you try to climb over. I'm just going to throw a fireball at that drow. Just All right. Thing. I thought that's what Jari did. Uh, 20. 20? That's definitely a hit. He's like, going, why won't they accept my surrender? <laughs> Jesus. Hey. Um, yeah, that's uh, 20. Or, or no, 20. 18. As he wonders why no one will accept the surrender, a ball of fire is burst <laughs> off, burst through his skull and out the other side. So 99%? Yeah, I'm just like dancing <laughs> And that's the last enemy on the board as this cloud starts wafting away. It's probably bad because it would have killed me. <laughs> oh, but we can't say that. <laughs> Joking. I rolled a 9, I got a 10. <laughs> I didn't take no damage that fight, then you can get that cloud. That dropped me over halfway at a point. 